what is up guys and welcome back to the channel so today is moving day for the chicken coop finally gonna move the chicken coop in place how exciting but I don't know how exciting it's gonna be with the way we're gonna move it I guess we're gonna have to find out um, so let me turn you around Let's take a look at what we're going to do. So, I got the chicken coop on this little Harbor Freight trailer that I have. Yes, by myself. Got her strapped down. Kind of, I guess. We'll see. And I got it hooked up to the four-wheeler. Now, I have low gear on the four-wheeler, but I don't know if low gear is going to be enough. Uh, many of you know Polaris's are a, a CVT transmission, so I don't know how that's going to handle it, but um, we're going to put it in low gear and give her a try. Now, although that chicken coop is pretty heavy, this thing doesn't seem to be squatting. It's probably because the, all the weight is balanced perfectly on that trailer. The only thing that the four-wheeler is doing is towing it. So anyways, uh, I'm going to set you guys up and uh, hopefully try to keep you out of the sun. And we're going to see how this goes. Alright guys, so as you can see, that thing did pretty well. Um, reverse, I think, is a little... Uh, I don't know what the gearing is in reverse. Um, not a big deal, but I do have it in the general area that I want. Uh, obviously, I do need to turn it. Um, turn you guys around here. So this door will be facing, you know, this side. So 
this is the general area where I want it so I will get it off the trailer and get it turned and as you can see I have four blocks there there and there uh, where this thing will sit so let me put you guys back down again and I'm gonna work on getting this thing off and into place Well, uh, that didn't go quite as planned. Uh, as you could see, I kind of almost lost that. Uh, I actually, it went on easier than it uh, came off, to be honest. But um, it's in place now, so that's a good thing. Uh, didn't tear it up that's another good thing so um, yeah I mean it's it's here feels sturdy something else I want to show you uh, this right here I guess I measured wrong or something that I wanted back further but it's not a huge deal um, that one and that one you can't really see it because it was painted black with some uh, gorilla spray stuff but uh, um, I had to make those uh, concrete cap blocks because uh, Lowe's didn't have any and I wasn't driving all over the place you know to find some so I just bought a bag of concrete and made a couple of them myself so I guess they turned out all right. They should do the job. Point of them is is just to keep the four by fours, the wood in general, uh, out of the dirt and hopefully make it last longer. So, but anyways, uh, right now, um, I'll I'll get back on here um, when. Uh, uh, when I see what I'm gonna do, um, I'll have to go inside and I have to go inside there. I need to move that, and then I'll have to cut some wire. Let me see if I can find a picture. But you see where that where that door is back in there. I got to get to that and at least cut that out for now and temporarily, you know, do something. And I got to get a ramp on there and get this uh, set up for them. So um, for right now, I think I'm going to go ahead and put you guys down. And I'm going to work on that. Uh, so I'll see you all in a bit. Alrighty guys, I'm back. I did a little bit of work. Uh, as you can see, I'll take you inside there. As you can see, maybe you can actually see, I cut the wire around the uh, chicken coop there. Uh, I used uh, poultry staples, but I think I want to get an actual uh, staple gun and staple 
that much better. Uh, there is a spot here, uh, you can see, I'll show you from the inside where I stapled it and then when I cut it the staples are kind of, the poultry staples aren't really doing too much. So uh, I'll have to just add a couple extras in there for now. Um, but real quick, I want to go over something else before I show you too much more. Um, I want to do something different with the nest box uh, on this chicken coop. Um, so I've decided to pick up some of these uh, tackle hatchery um, nest box pads. I'm not 100% sure uh, what they are. They are paper bags. Um, there's uh, supposed to be benefits to them. I mean, they're reusable. They absorb moisture. Like if you have a chicken, it's supposed to actually reduce, um, you know, cracked eggs and everything. Uh, and I just want to give them a try and see if they'll be better than shavings or, you know, messy straw. Uh, this is supposed to be similar to straw. So again, uh, I want to give it a try. So real quick here, let's go ahead and open this nest box. Take that off. Hard to do one hand. Um, as you can see, that's the inside of the nest box. So let me uh, open these up real quick. So let's let's start with this one right here. That just about fits perfect. It's actually a little snug, but that's okay. And then I'd rather it be a little snug. So I'll fluff that up for the chickens. They're gonna end up messing with it. Oops, sorry guys. Okay, and then let me grab another one. We're doing the easy ones first, if you can't tell. Yeah, a little tight for my application, but that's okay. I'm sure you can cut them down, too, if you needed to. But once the chickens get in here anyways, you know, they're going to be fluffing this all up. So real quick, uh, let me, let me go in the uh, old coop down there. Yeah, it's not on blocks anymore. Let me go in there and see how many eggs I have. Uh, I don't have any fake hands, <laughs> fake eggs on hand. Uh, so I'm just gonna see. One, two, three. Four, five. I've got five eggs. Must have missed one yesterday. See two more. So I'm gonna take and put one in each of those nesting boxes. Just for the time being, till they get used to uh, laying eggs over here. So put one there, one there, one there, one there, and I have one left over. I'll put it up here for now. So let's close this up. Done in here. Okay. Show you in here. So got the shavings down. That's what the inside's gonna look like now. There's the nesting boxes. see see the you can see the egg in that one maybe not that one but 
So, uh, I know, I know in previous video I had talked about an automatic door, uh, that has not arrived yet. Um, so, once that comes in, I'm gonna, I'll do a video on that. So, let's, uh, go back in here. Hi, chickens. And we're gonna go ahead, and yes, I have, I, I put their ramp together, um, but I don't have the rungs on it yet, but it's not very steep, so they should be able to walk on it. Um, I know I took this other latch off. I'm not going to put it back on right now, but I'm going to open that up. And it might take them a little bit because uh, I'm going to do some work, you know, just tidy up. i got to put a couple more poultry staples because that's what I have right now. And then zip tie this up and then re-zip tie the bottom for now until I can get wire. Uh, I'll probably be working on some wire and cinder blocks and stuff on the outside at a later time. So anyways, uh, I'm going to put you guys down again and I'm going to finish that up. And hopefully these chickens will uh, go in this coop soon. So if uh, this is the end of this video, um, I want to thank you all for watching. Please hit the thumbs up below. Drop us a comment. Let us know what you think. And if you haven't already, please subscribe to my channel. And we're going to catch you on the next one. Peace.